The following BLTV program is brought to you by O'Flaherty Law. Please enjoy. Hi, I'm Kevin O'Flaherty from O'Flaherty Law. I hope you find this Learn About Law video and podcast helpful. If you need some help, please feel free to give me a call at 630-324-6666. That's 630-324-6666. Thank you so much for watching and listening. Hi, this is Andrew with Learn About Law, and in this video we discuss what rights and options tenants have if their landlord defaults on the mortgage and the building goes into foreclosure. So with the economic impact wrought by the coronavirus pandemic, there has been a lot of talk about an avalanche of evictions in the very near future. But what about the tenants uh, that do pay their rent, but their landlord defaults on the mortgage and the building ends up in foreclosure? This is a very real concern for many tenants but thankfully, there are protections in place for just such an event. Resulting from the economic crisis of 2007-2008, and now the economic fallout from the coronavirus pandemic, laws have been structured to protect both tenants and landlords in foreclosure and non-paying situations, respectively. We often think of the landlord as the one with all the power in the landlord-tenant relationship, but in reality, they are just as much at risk when the economy flounders as their tenants. Whether purely from tenants being unable to pay rent, poor management of personal and business finances, or a combination of factors, landlords sometimes find themselves defaulting on their mortgage. The tenants' rights and duties are clear in Illinois, and they do not change just because their building is in foreclosure. Per the lease agreement, rent must be paid and the landlord or an appointed receiver must continue to function in the role of the landlord. In 2009, President Obama signed into law the Protecting Tenants Act at Foreclosure Act. The Protecting Tenants at Foreclosure Act provided the following benefits to tenants. One, the act permits tenants to remain in their dwelling until the end of their lease. Two, Tenants without a legal lease or whose lease recently expired are entitled to 90 days notice before having to vacate the property. Three, the buying of the foreclosed property can terminate a lease with 90 days notice. The law protecting Illinois renters against foreclosures apply to bona fide tenants who have bona fide leases. Bona fide tenants are those that fit into the following. The Illinois Mortgage Foreclosure Law is going to be another piece of legislature that provides protection for renters of a foreclosed property. Similar to other laws in place, it requires that new owners of a previously foreclosed property honor the existing lease agreement or provide adequate notice to tenants of the change in ownership and any new policies, giving the tenant time to relocate if desired. If you have any questions about landlord or tenant rights, please give us a call at 630-324-6666. And as always, thanks for tuning in. Hi, this is Kevin O'Flaherty again from O'Flaherty Law. Just want to let you know we offer free consultations in many areas of law, and we have several geographic locations for your convenience. So if you need some help, please feel free to give us a call at 630-324-6666. That's 630-324-6666. And thank you again for watching and listening.